What's going on everybody? My name is MDC and welcome to Astro Near. I'm quitting YouTube. I'm becoming an astronaut. That's it. GG. Good game. I'm done. And that's pretty much what's going down. No, I'm just kidding. But for real guys, today we are playing Astro Near. It's a brand new game from Steam. Okay, it's an early access. It's a world builder, explorer, trade, space, everything you want in a space game where you explore and stuff like that. That's right. It's going to be great. We're going to do this together. Okay? Now, what we're going to do is start off, we're going to pick one of our little astronauts we want to be. And I want to be this weird skinny guy, so let's go do that right now. Alright, that's what I'm talking about. We're shipping off, and we're going on our thing. This is a beautiful game. This is an amazingly beautiful game. It's a very innovative game. I'm, I, I'm so excited, we just went through that cloud, to get you know jump into this game and have some fun. I have played this already. I've already played a little bit of this game, so what we're going to be doing today is I'm going to explain to you some stuff all right so what we're gonna do is when you first you hit tab you get out of your get out of your space pod okay now there's this little circle thing that's circling your space pod all right so you're gonna click on that that's gonna give you the first compound thing to build onto your space station is that what you're building is a space station or a base we're building a base maybe so that's the first thing we're gonna do now what you need to be complete this transaction this building whatever it is is resin and I'm gonna show you what resin is okay so what you have you press E okay now E is your terrain tool now what your terrain tool does is you can shape the land however you want like this it's pretty crazy and you also get minerals and stuff that way which I'm gonna show you right now is you know where to get your common minerals and your material that you need to build objects in this game now these weird spherical rectangle things this is resin so you're gonna just simply collect it you know but be careful you know you're gonna you are gonna run out of power like right there your backpack has a power level the little yellow rings on it right there that it, it generates it gets its power back slowly by itself but it's very slow to begin with you put your resin on there, and it's going to build your second circle. Now, this is going to evolve into your second circle. I don't know. Well, you need two resins to complete the next one. So we're just going to get some little power up real quick. And we're going to go back. And I'm, pr I'm probably going to get this resin fairly quickly. I already got one. So go ahead and collect some more resin. Let's run back to the base. When you do run, your oxygen depletes faster, by the way. That blue bar on the back of my backpack, that's your oxygen level. When that runs out, you die. You don't want that to happen. That's bad. So we're back at our base. We're going to go ahead and put two of these on here. Now, this is going to give you this thing. Whatever that thing is right there. Okay, so you can choose from a different... You can choose between different things you can build. You can build a research, a smelter, a vehicle bay, a printer. And I think the first thing we're going to build is, I think, a research facility. For the sake of this video, our first thing we're going to build is we're on a mission to build our research facility. And you'll see what the research facility is used for later. So for right now, we're going to leave that right there. Next thing I'm going to show you guys, and it's very, very important, is the main compound mineral that you're going to be using to build many many objects in this game and that is just the basic compound mineral it's very it's, this is called compound that's that's all it is is compound so we're going to collect a bunch of compound and the reason compound is so important is because if you notice like well, oxygen is depleting right the oxygen is going down but you know you have to go all the way back to your base right to breathe like that when the little blue thing connects to you puts up your oxygen level right there all right so what we're going to be doing is we're going to go into our backpack so press q this opens up your backpack and this is going to a tether and we're going to build some tethers now you use basic mineral compounds to build tethers okay now i'm going to go ahead and build two tethers i'm going to get two things of tethers because i know i need a lot of tethers all right so tether place tether let me show you exactly what a tether does you put a tether down that blue line right there and guess what you can walk this far and get oxygen it's pretty cool right it's pretty cool so I st I like to strategically place my tethers next tr next to nodes so I can go and collect resources when needed like this I put the tether right here I can walk right up to this and collect these these are power resources resources power resources <laughs> so we got that now next thing we're gonna do is let's just adventure out a little bit longer and this is oxygen so I'm gonna go ahead and collect some of this oxygen now what, remember what we're, our main mission right now is to build a research facility I think it needs compound right so 
I'm going to go and collect some compound minerals for my research facility. It's full. I only have one spot open. Power right there. Right there. Put this power right there. Excellent. We get all of this compound mineral. I want all of the compound mineral. More. Oh, that's all? Okay, I'm full. I gotta go back, guys. I'm full. So you see we got our compound minerals. We're gonna go ahead and build our research facility. That. And... There we go. Research facility. Now, a couple things you need for your research facility is power, which is the yellow that you see right there powering up these little yellow bars right there, guys, right there. And, um, yeah, so you need power. And the other thing is you need something to research. Now, we're going to go find a research pod together. And I need to find out where I can find a research pod at. I think, let me look around a little bit. I can, I kind of have a good eye for this stuff now. I've already played the game a couple times. Let me go find this research pod. I'm going to build, I'm going to start another tether out this way to go look for some research pods. We found water, guys. Water on this planet. On planet MDC has water. That means there might be life. There might be life on this planet. I'm just I'm just kidding. I don't, I don't know if there's life on this planet. Don't listen to me. I'm crazy. What is this? What is this big circle thing? Oh my god. Holy crap. <gasps> Copper. Oh my god. That's so cool. Is this, this is man-made. This is like materials that have been sent to us or something? Okay. Let me, uh, collect this copper real quick. Give me some of that compound. I like that compound. Yes, I do. Okay, well, whoever sent that to me, thank you very much. That's very nice of you. And by the way, guys, the planets that you are on in this game are huge. All right. And looking around, looking around. Oh, there's a cave. Perfect. There's always research materials in caves. You'll see what I'm saying once we get there. We're going to go off to this cave find a research material, and then research it. I'm a great astronaut. And there we go, guys. Just a fun little fact, whenever you go to caves, they have a lot of research materials, which is unknown. It's an unknown big blob object thing. And you just pick it up with your magical force abilities, like you're a Jedi or something. And then, yeah, you take it. And this little big ball of wonderfulness right here, we're gonna take that back to our base and we're gonna research it and find out what is inside of here. But you take these wonderful big balls of amazingness back to your base and you research them and it gives you different things to build. It's kind of cool. You'll see what I'm talking about. Running across here. Oh, oh, no, 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 don't fall in there. You don't want to fall in there. All you're gonna do is you take your big ball of wonderfulness and put it up here. And then that little orange button right there. You click it. Make sure your power is full, by the way. You need your power to be full. And here we go. Let's find out what we researched. I'm actually excited. I don't know. Oh, it opens up like a Pokeball. And what is it? Trade platform. Oh, crap. We researched a trade platform. But guys, this right here, this is a storm. These happen all the time. Sometimes they bring really big rocks, and you got to get in the middle of your, uh, cave, your uh, thing because it will kill you. These, these uh, sandstorms are very dangerous. Oh my god, sandstorm. That's what I'm talking about. Those rocks are very dangerous, people. You don't want to get hit by those rocks, because when you get hit by those rocks, you get smacked in the head like that, and you'll die, and then that's pretty much what's going on. All you got, all you can do is wait for it to pass. That's, that's all you can do is wait for the sandstorm to pass. Hey, that's not very nice. Hey, stop hitting my research platform. That's my equipment. You're treating it like crap. Hey. Watch out. Why are the rocks squares? The rocks are squares, guys. We're getting hit by square asteroids, square rocks in the sandstorm. And there it goes. Say bye-bye, sandstorm. We are safe. Now, you get caught up in one of those when you're out adventuring. It's no bueno. What happens is you'll die, and you have to go find your body again just to get your stuff back. It's not fun. All right, guys. So what we're going to do next is we are going to build one of these. Put a resin right there. I need a little bit more resin before I end this video because we're going to start building our vehicle bay, our vehicle platform thing. Because I like vehicles. Give me the resin. I like resin. Put our resin down, boys. All right. Vehicle bay. We need aluminum. How do you make aluminum? Where do you even get aluminum from? Okay, guys, I hope you really enjoyed this. This is going to be a great adventure. We're off to a really, really good start. We have our research facility. We're working on our vehicle bay next, and we covered the basics of what's going to be going on. We discovered co regular compound minerals, resin minerals, um, what was the other thing? Oh yeah, we found some copper. 
we're gonna find out what we're gonna be using some copper for probably in the next video to come and uh, yeah we actually survived our first sandstorm but I really do not hope we get caught in a sandstorm in the future when we're out adventuring because that's not fun I don't want to go find my body but anyway I hope you guys did enjoy next video we're gonna be building building this vehicle bay and seeing what kind of vehicles we can we can build in order to explore this planet better planet MDC that's right our planet our planet I'll see you guys in the next video thank you very much and peace yeah.